Good morning, guys. It's been a while. It's been crazy busy with holidays and work and everything else. Um, I have an unboxing for you, and then I'm just going to chit-chat a little bit while I work on my diamond painting to tell you some of the things that have been going on. Um, I am still sick. When I went to the doctor the last time, they put me on z -Pack. And z pack does nothing for me. Um, there's a story behind that, too, involving when I ha gave birth to my daughter. Um, they waited, like, 30-some hours after my water broke. And I ended up with a bad infection, so I had an emergency C-section. And ever since then, certain antibiotics do absolutely nothing for me, and they insist on putting me on z pack every time. And if they would look, just in the year that I've been here, I've been in three times for the same thing, and every time they put me on z pack and I end up having to go back in a month later because the z pack will calm it down, but it never goes away, and then it comes back worse. And my husband's been really pissed because I'm refusing to go to the doctor because, number one, I don't want to miss work because it's almost Christmas. Number two, um, I already have like $500 in doctor bills from my hand and from being sick this last time because I went in and they put me on the z pack and then a few days later, or like three or four days later, I went back in because I ended up with a um, bulging disc in my neck from coughing too hard. So I don't want to go in and... He's getting kind of upset because he thinks I have pneumonia, but I haven't had a fever, so I don't worry about it. Um, but I'm going to do the unboxing first. I think I hear my daughter get... Remember what store this is from. Hi, baby. You're up early. Look at your wild hair this morning. Yes, I'm going to put it together today. Not yet. Okay, so this painting is from Home Fun. Home Fun. I've never ordered one from there before. I hope I can see what it is. Um, you didn't even give me a chance to work on my painting this morning, Hannah. This one, I'm going to work on it for a little bit before you got up. I need to get my snowman done. So they do that their little tube. There are those colors. Should be more greens. There should be a lot of greens. Can you see that?
some. Little green. There's not very many greens in here. One, two, three, four, five. It has 40 colors. Oh, I guess there won't be too much green. It's Like a glimpse movie and a glimpse, like a glimpse movie and a glimpse painting. They must have a lot of blues rather than greens mixed in with his paint. There's some kind of different colored blues in here. I really like the glimpse now, and Max is so cute. Yeah, and the glimpse. It's a portrait team that's kind of a gray color, you know, like. And I double like lion. There's another color green, I guess. Okay. And. Color green. I have these red ones. And. And and this one's pretty always uh yeah. I'm glad they didn't put tape. I hate it when they put that tape around it. It seems like their tape does not like to come off. This is a 40 by 60. My, I don't the kid, my own kitty. So, uh, and my own kitty name is Carmel. Um, Thanksgiving, well, a couple days before Thanksgiving, actually. The boys kind of had issues with that kitten that we had gotten. Um, the yeah. lady we got it from did not, does not take care. We're trying to get her shut down. Um, she's just not take care of those cats. She doesn't get them to the vet. We think she lies about giving the cats shots. They have like upper respiratory infections, but she's only treating them with eye drops. And we had Titus. And I love him. And... Few days before Thanksgiving, he started acting really weird. Like he wouldn't. So my aunt's kitty name. Canvas. My the Nice to see that because this new can. I would I would love to just throw it in the trash, but I didn't have any other Christmas ones, and obviously I'm not gonna be able to get this one done. I've got two other ones I need to get done for presents yet. Um. I'm going to be contacting them because I have two more that I ordered at the same time. And the, the drills for these are horrible. They're popping up all over. They're too big. The black are too mine, small. Mine, mine. They're stuck together really bad. Um, yes, baby. I told them um, that one's to the name. Yeah, I know you did. Huh? But yeah, and those who can, it's actually absolutely horrible i would just love to throw them away i have two more that i got at the same time the moana for her and then um jack from the nightmare before christmas and they're pretty decent sizes and i know her print is horrible on her moana one too so i don't know what to do it's been it's uh, this one's only a 40 by 40 and it's taken me forever to do it because i just I can't see the symbols. I don't know. I use my phone and there's certain ones I still can't tell the difference or which symbol it's supposed to be. Um, anyway, the, the cat. 
so he started acting really weird, sleeping all the time. He wouldn't really hardly do anything. And then it was the Tuesday before Thanksgiving. The Tuesday before Thanksgiving, he was like just laying there and couldn't move. Like, I tried to pick him up because I got him some food, and I went to pick him up to bring him to his dish, and he could not stand up. It's like, great. So my husband called the a different vet because we brought our cats and the vet because we had, I just was on antibiotics, and he, Tessa still has a huge lump on her back from the way he treated her when giving her shots, so we decided we would never go to this guy again. So he called the vet while well, they couldn't get Titus in until Friday, the day after Thanksgiving. So, you know, we just, whatever, you know. And he came out of it while I was at work on Tuesday, walking around, eating. It's fine. Tuesday morning, he was fine. And then he went back into, or Wednesday, I mean, he went back into that. So he was just kind of going in and out. He started having seizures, which reminded me of a dog I had gotten. Um, I got it at a pet store, and it had its papers, everything, all its shots. Well, he started having, or she started having seizures a few years down the road, and it turns out she never did give him the shots. The pet store got shut down because of it. So... Okay. Um, how much is it Um, so we didn't know if that lady even had actually given him those shots or not. So he was in and out, and Thanksgiving he was just, he was fine that morning, I think that, I don't know. yeah, I got up in the middle of the night, and he was fine, Thanksgiving morning, it was like 4 a.m., he was walk following me around downstairs, well then, when I got up that morning, he was just back to seizing, and not moving, not eating, nothing, well, it's like, okay, you just need to make it till 3 p.m. tomorrow, you know, one more day. And it just didn't happen. Um, luckily, it was 9 p.m. after Hannah was in bed. My husband actually got up to go get some something to drink, and he came upstairs and asked about a shoebox. So I came down, and he was gone. So, after work Friday morning, I had to explain that to Hannah, which was not a fun thing to have to explain to a four-year-old, and the fact that it happened on Thanksgiving is just... So, we ended up, I contacted the lady we, I had gotten Tessa from, it was the All Cats Rescue, and filled out an application for a cat, and then... We ended up emailing her Friday because we wanted to go get him right away just to help her. And same as last time, I emailed her and she got back to me. You send the application and they take a while to get back to you. But as soon as I emailed her, it wasn't 10 minutes later. And she's like, oh, you got a cat from us before, so I don't really need to go through the application, blah, blah, blah. And we ended up getting Carmel, and he is, we absolutely love him. He is an amazing cat, very loving, loves to snuggle, um, playful. He's four months old, but he is big for four months old. I couldn't believe it when I seen he was four months old at how big he is. So he is going to be a huge cat. But he's a good kitty, huh? He meows a lot. Felt kind of bad because he was in with two of his brothers so I think that's part of the issue right now is he's used to being with his brothers um, it 
took Tessa about two to three days. And then she was good with them. So now they play and wrestle and get along fine. So you like, you like, uh, I don't know. Yeah, he's a good kitty. So that's that. Um, the two that have not gotten your paintings, I did finally get them in the mail on Thursday. I apologize. It took me so long to get them. But between the happenings of um, Titus and then going back to work. At, I mean, we, the shutdown, we were there six, seven hours every day anyway. So it wasn't really much of a shutdown. And most of the time... They were supposed to grab a few of us to go do some stuff and then swap it with a few more di people. Well, apparently girls can't work because the girls ended up sitting downstairs the whole time and the guys went to work. The only thing that they had any girls do was clean lockers, the outside of lockers. So I literally sat in the break room the first day. Well, I sat in the break room for two hours and we got kicked out of the break room and had to go to the locker room. And I sat there for three or four hours, and then I was able to go back to, you know, what was that, an hour in the break room, four hours in the locker room, and then the last hour or so back in the break room. So it was miserable. Tuesday, we were there for an hour and a half, I think. They were supposed to be shutting the power down, so we didn't have to stay that day. Wednesday was the same thing. I did nothing but sit. Thursday, I had to go pick trash and cigarette butts up out of the parking lot. Friday. What did I do on Friday? I don't think... I don't think I did anything on Friday. Monday... Sat around most of the day. They said they had this big, huge, long list of stuff for us to do, but we sat there, everybody sat there for three hours or more doing nothing. And then they had to put a, some posts in for a fence because they were adding another little parking lot. It's like, how are you going to do that? The ground is froze. So me and this other girl went out to watch. Well, here there was only two people out there to do it. So we ended up placing, moving the posts where they needed to um, put them. But then it turned out that there was like some chunks of cement and a cement pad so they couldn't even get the posts in. So we had to sit around and wait for them to decide what they were going to do. Then they took out all these boxes of paper, old paperwork. And um, there was a few people out there and it's like... I didn't even know that they had started doing that, so then, because my husband took me over and showed me Harvest, so then I went back downstairs and grabbed my hard hat, and it's like, whatever, I went out there, I was the only girl that was out there, and the only reason we were still there that late that day was because a lot of them were refusing to do anything, so they just sat downstairs the whole time it's like the sooner we get the stuff done the sooner we can get home why sit here when we get paid eight hours rather than we're here for five minutes or here for you know six or seven hours we still get eight hours so you think you'd want to get out of there faster so i went on there outside and flew through all those boxes so we could get out of there well then they were still on that stupid trying to get posts in the ground and they took a jackhammer out there and they finally got the post in, and then we were finally able to go home. And then we started up on Tuesday at 10. And we've been doing nine hours a day since. Except for yesterday, we were supposed to work today, and they canceled it because we're supposed to get like 10 inches of snow. Well, it's still raining. It's been raining since yesterday, so when the temperature drops, it's going to be a slick one outside. I bought a um, train set to go around her Christmas tree yesterday, so my daughter's playing with it. But, oh, I was going to show you this. Black Friday, we went to get the cat, so I wanted to go to Michael's, and I 
I ended up spending $150 and I saved like a hundred and some dollars. My bell should have been way over 200 anyway. So I got frames where buy one get two free. So I got three 30 some dollar frames for the $30. I mean, I couldn't, I don't necessarily, my husband even asked, oh, what are these frames for? I said, I don't know, they're buy one get two free. I am I had to buy them. Um, I think they're 40 by 50 size frames. And then I got these for my daughter because she really likes doing those stickers. So I got her some diamond dot bracelets, which she started on. I'm ha I bought her these so she could make people Christmas presents. So she started on this one. I was a little worried that they weren't gonna stay on there, they were gonna fall off, but this stuff that they put on here is so sticky, they are not gonna fall off. Because I've tried to move some, and I could barely get them moved probably 10 or 15 minutes after she placed them, I could hardly move the darn thing, so. And then I got this, which is magnets. So she can make girls bracelets and she can make my dad and um, her cousin Matthew a um, magnet and her uh, uncle. So I'm trying to get her to work on that stuff while I work on mine. I'm never going to get, I won't get my dad's painting done by Christmas, but I probably won't see him. For, I don't know when I'll end up seeing him, but hopefully I can get it done before I do. Because this is a 60 by 70, I think. And I haven't got, I'm, I started a long time ago, but I didn't get very far. My mom's, I still only have the top strip. I can show you my snowman, but this thing is a nightmare to deal with. Absolute nightmare. Hopefully no drills fall off. I only have one strip left, so I'm hoping to get that done today. There's some, like the snowflake is just like a square. I'm gonna probably take that off. And there's another one down there that I'm probably gonna take off. There, I'm probably gonna take off because this is like this is so weird. There is no no white at all in this picture, which I don't always like. It's like a creamy. I think it's fifteen. No, there's no like three eight six five. Off white or creamy white. Um, I wish they would have used that color for the hat, but like a nice white for the snowman. But that's, I don't know. The colors are kind of strange. I see one drill came off. Yeah. It's, I just need to hurry up and get it done and get it in a frame and never deal with it again. Um, I don't know what I'm going to end up doing with it. I'll hang it up for Christmas this year, and I don't know what I'm going to do with it after that, because even looking at it just irritates me, because it's been, even the canvas is just like a chintzy, thin, um, I'm not liking it at all. I'm just frustrated with it. I actually look for Christmas one at, when I was at Michael's, but they were sold out of all the Christmas ones. So that was a bummer, but at least I was able to find these things. I tried looking last time and they didn't have any, so I finally was able to get some of those. But anyways, this video is getting kind of long, so I will let you guys go. You guys have a good day, and like I said, your paintings, the two people that got the cat 
paintings, Lorma, and I don't remember who the other one was. They should be here probably by Tuesday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, somewhere in there. I don't, I couldn't find my receipt this morning to tell you when it was supposed to be there, but you should be getting it early part of next week. Okay, guys, you have a good day, and I will talk to you soon.